hello guys welcome to how to fix stack in this video guys every windows user should have this toolkit i mean the usb flash drive so basically what happens when you make your usb bootable you are only able to boot only one operating system from your usb but in this video guys i'm going to show you you can use this tool as multiple iso or multiple operating system you can just you need to put into it or you can use these recovery tools while your system or window crashes so first of all in order to download that tool if you want to recover your pc as well as you want to install many iso so we need to download here the win toy this is a popular tool for it professionals so first link click on that download tool Okay, once you go here, you will see Ventoy bootable USB solution. Uh, select as per your choice. I am going to select here Windows. You can also Linux and other live CD. So click on first link here, Windows. Since we are going to install the Windows Ventoy. Now click on latest version here. So this is a new interface you should not get this as well as in the old videos so it's going to download now okay let me scan that now it's downloaded now okay I have already tested this tool so it is in the zip file so let me close this out from here now insert your pen drive here so make sure you have inserted your pen drive properly so my pen drive is usb e so make note of it and then go to download here and you need to right click on the zip file and click on 7 zip and extract to this now new folder will be created here the zip we have unzip this double click on it and now double click on again now we should get the exe ventor disk dot exe make a double click on it click on yes button when the prompt opens to give the permission just you need to wait here now click on install it should automatically pick your usb flash drive but you can also manually select that make sure you are selecting that all the data from your this drive will be deleted so make sure you have backup your data before click on install so click on install uh, I have bootable pen drive of Windows 10 so I'm going to test with the Windows 11 and 10 both yes so it's going to download now and if you have forgotten your password or not able to access your PC like blue screen of death errors you are getting so you can download here Hiren boot go to this link Hiren CD and once you go to this just go to download option here close the advertisement okay it's loading so now you can see it is 73 percent now Vento has been successfully installed so now it's ready to boot now so first you need to download the different ISO like I'm going to also boot the ISO of the Hiren boot so this is a different and Windows 10 you can download here Windows 10 installation ISO click on this as well as if you have the Windows 11 ISO you just need to have the ISO file of that operating system and we can 
make the multiple bootable from this vent toy like click on here start multi audition click on download so since I have already downloaded all the USB here only I'm going to download this so go to Windows 10 ISO and also Windows 11 ISO start the download from here and choose your language I'm going to select here English International confirm that and click on just download 64 bit okay so once you have downloaded the windows 10 and 11 iso and also the hidden boot let me show you the work of this usb so let me minimize this here and i have already downloaded the all the windows 10 as well as windows 11 iso let me show you here in the share folder so you can see here i have windows 10 iso as well as the windows 11 iso as well as ubuntu so let me show you with the windows 10 and ubuntu here so let me select here ubuntu and windows 10 just make a right click on it and just you need to drag these folders or the iso into the Ventoy. Just copy these two files and just we need to paste only here. You don't need to do anything now, just drag and drop. You don't need to make it bootable. So let me pause the video once it is done. I will resume that. So now we have successfully just put the Windows 10 and Ubuntu image inside the Ventoy now 5GB is still free now and hidden boot is still it is taking more time so we have to cancel this process as of now so let me show you what you can do with this okay so let me restart my system and then making the video with my phone so this is a pen drive guys uh, let me insert the pen drive here So this is the SanDisk pen drive. So you can see here Ventoy. Let me restart my system and press the bootable key here. It is F10 in the HP laptop. You can search on the Google what is the BIOS key or the bootable key for your laptop. And make sure you set the priority on the up. So it's taking the administrator password here hit enter now in the boot order make sure you have chosen the USB first okay so you can press here the value here for F6 the change value so if I press F6 here f5 it is going down but if i press f6 it is going up so make sure you have chosen that and then f10 and yes and system is automatically boot from the pen drive it should boot now and it will show me two options here you can see Ubuntu as well as Windows 10 ISO is here so let's say if you have the Windows 10 in it and you want to repair it you can hit enter here and in the normal mode you can also check it press any key and my laptop is going to boot from this pen drive
and thereafter I can use it and use the multiple functions now you can see when I click on next here then click on repair your system if your system is not booting so you have couple of options here you can restore it you can uninstall update you can boot into the safe mode startup repair you can also you can also turn off or the use the disk image here so these are the options you can enable here if I continue with Windows 10 so let me remove the pen drive from here now okay it is automatically booted here if I want to install the Ubuntu in the normal mode you can see here you can see try Ubuntu so these are the helpful and the powerful method of this toolkit so you can use it in a multiple operating system inside it like Ubuntu, ISO, Windows 10, Ubuntu like any version Windows 10, 11, 7 all versions you can use it inside your one pen drive so hope this video useful for you guys if yes then hit like subscribe and share thank you thanks for watching how to fix tech